A Greek political party that opposes the EU bailout is struggling to form a coalition government. After the winning New Democracy Party failed to form a government on Monday, runner-up Alexis Tsipras and his radical left coalition got the mandate. Al Jazeera reports. But Mr. Tsipras will have to be extremely persuasive to pull this off. He needs to bring political enemies together in what would be an unlikely coalition. Euronews reports Tsipras is clear about his coalition's goals. Tsipras himself has ruled out any continuation of austerity and scrapping the IMF and EU bailout deals. And the communists have ruled out any role in the coalition. The Greek Ekatha Marini reports Tsipras released a plan he wants as a basis for negotiations. It calls for the immediate cancellation of austerity measures and a reform of the political system. Tsipras wants to make sure the will of the people doesn't get lost in the political negotiations, saying, We are not indifferent to whether the country will be governed or not, but we are primarily concerned with the direction in which the country will be governed and whether the people's mandate will be respected. If Tsipras fails to form a government by the Friday deadline, the country will have to hold elections again. A writer for The Telegraph explains the outcome of a possible delay. A failure to put together a government this week would trigger another election in June, increasing fears that Greece's painful deficit-cutting program, along with Europe's faltering efforts to resolve its debt crisis, could be derailed. EU leaders are warning Greece not to abandon austerity measures. The BBC reports European Commission President Jose Manuel Barroso said on Tuesday, what member states have to do is be consistent implementing the policies that they have agreed. According to Reuters, Germany has threatened to withhold aid until Greece continues to comply with the bailout conditions. For Newsy, I'm Christina Hartman. Multiple sources, the real story.